this tutorial, we're going to just see how to get the x and y coordinates of mouse when you move mouse over the form. So let's quickly rename the form first. We're going to rename the text as go to the properties, go to the text, and rename it as mouse coordinate. I'm driving a bit right. Great mouse coordinates. Now go to the menu and toolbar section of the toolbox in Visual Studio and just try and drop a state strip into the form. Great, you have a state strip. Now click on the little drop down arrow over here, add a state is label. Automatically, the state is label is labeled as a tool strip label one. So I'm going to go to the properties and Black out the text. Great. Now click on the form. Go to the properties. Click on the lightning icon over here to go to the events of the form. And we're going to go to mouse move. So all the mouse movements have the event arguments. The event arguments over here with the mouse move is going to have e dot x and e dot y, which is the x and y coordinates of the current mouse pixels. Double click over here. Great, we have it over here. Now, all we need to do is uh, this. Yeah, tool strip label one dot. We're going to take set the text equals. We're going to set it to e dot x plus. We're going to concatenate the string. We're going to put a comma for the y. It's going to be e dot y. Wait. I've got to put a concatenate symbol over here. Uh, that's great. Hit control A, control K, F to format the code. Like that. Hit the F I key. Great. Uh, I hope you can see the pixels, I mean the current pixels for the mouse is hovering. Uh, these kind of effects are used in uh, Photoshop, Adobe, almost all the products use this in order to just have an indication of where the mouse pointer is. Great. Yes, thanks for watching the tutorial.